send Tracker out on a mission. <laughs> Come in. Hey, Chase. How's it going? Daddy, would you like to have some playtime? Hmm, playtime, huh? Hold on a second. You know what? I'd love to have some playtime with you. Can you give me about five minutes? Of course. All right, big boy. I'll see you in a few minutes. Yes. Chase, thank you so much for inviting me to play with you. I'm so excited to be here. Wow, what is this? What are we looking at? It's the Lookout Tower! The Paw Patrol Lookout Tower? I love it, it's so big. My goodness, look, we have Sky, we have Zuma, we have Chase, Marshall, Rocky, we have Rubble, and of course, who's our leader? Rhydon! He's our fearless leader that takes us out to do our missions. Yes. This is the mighty lookout tower. Whoa, that's even more special because it's a mighty lookout tower. Does it have an elevator that goes up and down? <gasps> wow! Oh, did you? Visa! I like it. We have a satellite and a little badge. How about if before we start this playtime today, we use our imaginations and see if we can imagine ourselves in Adventure Bay? Yeah! All right, let's close our eyes, use our imaginations, and see if we can imagine ourselves in Adventure Bay! That's even cool! Look at that! That's the beach there! What do you think they call it Adventure Bay for anyways? I don't know. Maybe because there's adventures? And there's a bay! It's like a little beach right in the town. This is so much fun. Who are the two pups we're gonna send down the elevator shaft? Who's the opposite of Rubble and Rocky? I don't know. Who is the opposite of Rubble and Rocky? They're the opposite! Oh, they are opposites. Let's go ahead and send them down the elevator. Wow! And how about if we send them up, does it make a noise? Yes! High five! And you know what else the Paw Patrol Lookout Tower does? It shoots cars out, doesn't it? Yeah! Why don't you choose which car we want to shoot out first, Chase? Do you want to choose one? Uh, how about... Tracker! A tracker? Good! If you give me Tracker, I will attach him to this little gizmo and he can go down the shaft, just like they do when they're ready for a mission. All right, I'm gonna hook Tracker up to his little device so that he can come down the slide, land in his car, and get ready for a mission. Do you wanna send him down the slide and give him a little push? Yeah. There he goes. Here, here comes Tracker, and I'm there he is. And then he lands on his hatch door and he's ready for action. Now wait, wait, how about if you put countdown and then you launch him out? Yeah. Okay. Send Tracker out on a mission. How did you do that? You just push that button? It's yep. so neat. I Let did this. Really good, Chase. Now that we have our own Paw Patrol little universe with all of these toys and these cars and the lookout tower, we can make up our own Paw Patrol mission. Would you like to do that? Yeah! It would be so much fun. There's one thing that when I tell a story, it makes it a lot easier when we have a bad guy. Because then there's a challenge and we have to figure out how to work through the challenge when there's a bad guy trying to make things hard for us. Yeah. In Adventure Bay, we already have a bad guy, don't we? What's his name? Mayor Hunt. So. He's not living. 
No, he lives in Foggy Bottom, you're right. He's the mayor of Foggy Bottom. He's always jealous of the Paw Patrol, isn't he? He's a he's he's jealous of Adventure Bay and all of the fun that the people in Adventure Bay have. Now, Adventure Bay has its own mayor too, right? Is she good or bad? Good. Of course she's good. Her name is Goodway. How no, much better? No, it's Mayor Goodway. It's Mayor Goodway. How much better of a name can you get than that? That's a pretty good sign that she's good. So Humdinger is naughty, Goodway is our good mayor. Yes. Mayor Humdinger is always jealous of the people in Adventure Bay, isn't he? Yeah. He always tries to make it just a little more difficult. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. One morning, really early in Adventure Bay, when everyone was still asleep and they hadn't woken up yet, where were all the pups sleeping? In their car. Yes, they sleep in their cars. Can you help them? Thank you. Here's Sky. Can I put Chase in his car? And Marshall. Here you go, Marshall. Oh, I have Rockies over here. I have Zumas over here. And Rubble, tell you what, Rubble's parked his car over here. Can I put him in here? No, I I have a free space on mine. Oh, here you go. Should I give you the whole thing? There you go. You have a free space on your side. Very good. That's the symbol over here. Nice. Okay. So, you know, um, for this story, I was thinking we could use that slinky of yours. You know that colorful slinky I you know guys have? I know that is. The reason I thought we could use this slinky is because it looks like a rainbow. So one morning, it was so early that even Ryder was still asleep. Don't you think Ryder's probably the first one to wake up in the yes, morning? Yes, he is. He is because he's responsible. He likes to keep Adventure Bay safe for everyone. Yes. He's the first one to wake up. So he looks out of his window and what does he see? A rainbow. It's like a slinky rainbow. He's like, what is this? I didn't put that there. How about if he calls Rubble? But he looks in also. He looks in and it's just a big black hole in there. So he's going to call Rubble to come and help. Can you help Rubble get up on the elevator, please? Uh, Rubble, yeah. I need you up here because something is weird up on the lookout tower. Rubble says, I'll be right there, Ryder, sir. So Ryder waits. He hears the elevator come up. Good. But then Rubble doesn't show up. And he's like, Rubble, are you there? Rubble. So Ryder gets up and he looks down and Rubble's not there. He disappeared. He's just gone. He's like, that's strange. Is Rubble playing hide and seek with me? He's like, how about if I call Rocky next? Rocky, can you please wake up? Oh, yes, Ryder. Uh, what do you need me for? Green means go. Here I come. Uh, Rocky, can you please come up here? There's something really strange on the lookout tower. Rocky's like, I'll be right there. Rocky goes up. Ryder waits a minute. Ryder doesn't hear Rocky. He looks in and he's like, uh-oh, Rocky disappeared too. This must be a rainbow vortex. They're disappearing inside of this rainbow vortex. There's something strange going on here. It's like a portal and they're going into it and not coming out. <laughs> this is the game. So he's like, uh-oh, two of my pups have disappeared in this rainbow vortex, right, Chase? I better not have anyone else come up the elevator. They might disappear too. So instead, I'm gonna call Sky and Chase and Marshall. Can you please wake up? Yes, sir, Ryder, sir, we're awake. What do you need? I need you guys to come up here because something strange is going on. There's some kind of a rainbow vortex at the top of the lookout tower, but don't come up the elevator because we've already had two of our pups disappear. We've had Rubble and we've had Rocky and they both disappeared. Sky's like, we'll be there right now, but we'll come up in my helicopter. Perfect, thank you, Chase. You brought them up through the helicopter so that they wouldn't go in the vortex and disappear. Where's Sky? How about we put Sky right here? So writers like everybody, I need you to listen up. This is an emergency. Something is going on here. This rainbow vortex has already taken two of our Paw Patrol members and they're like where is it taking them to and Ryder's like I don't know but we have to figure out because our friends are gone and we have to get them back so Chase scratched his head and he thought how are we gonna find where our friends went to they all disappeared in this rainbow vortex and Chase said you know what Ryder I think I have an idea of how we can find out where they disappeared to how about if we use my drone I have a camera on my drone doesn't he have a camera on his drone yeah how about if we throw the camera down the vortex and then we can find where it went to? Yeah! Good idea, Chase. Can you help me throw it down? There we go. Good job. It fell down all by itself. 
Now we're gonna look on the screen of my truck, said Chase, and we're gonna find out where the camera went. And it went around, and it's around, and it's around, until it finally landed in Foggy Bottom. <gasps> That's Foggy Bottom, and there's, there's rubble. And look, there's Rocky, and they're inside of a jail, and is that? That's Mayor Humdinger. It's him, he's been up to this this whole time. Now we know where they are, and we have a mission on our hands. We need to go save them. We need to drive our vehicles and start this mission and go to Foggy Bottom so we can save our friends. Are you guys up for the challenge? Yeah! So Ryder says, Chase, I'm gonna need you for this mission. Marshall, I'm gonna need you for this mission. And Sky, I need you for this mission too. Are you all ready? Him too! Are you all ready to go down the chute? What ch what car do you think we should use, Chase? The big one? The big one. All right, Chase. let's send Chase let's down first. Chase. Fancy! That's really nice. Are you ready to send Chase down the chute? Here you yeah. go. Go ahead and send him down and get him in the driver's seat. Ready for this mission, Ryder, sir. Nice yeah. slide all the way down and he jumps and lands right in his truck in the driver's seat. Next we have Marshall. Marshall, I'm ready for action too. Don't, don't forget me. Wait for me, please. Here you go. You want to send Marshall down? Here I come! Yes, perfect ride down. Aw, oh, and here's Skye. Let's be nice and gentle with Skye. Skye, are you ready to go down? Yes, of course. This pup is always ready to fly. We need to be really gentle with Skye. She is ready to fly. Can you send her down the hatch, please? Here she comes! Nice slide all the way down. Let's go ahead and put her in. Is there anyone else that you want to bring on this mission, Chase? How about I like that. Let's go ahead and put Tracker in one of the side... Oh, how about we put him in one of the side carriages? Nice. Now we have Ryder. He's the last one. Now, doesn't Ryder normally go on an ATV? Oh, look, we have two Riders over there with ATVs. Which oh, one do you want to use? that's the white one. Yeah, we found it. We found the big you one. You put him on. We found the big one and I put him on. All right, now that we're ready for our mission, who's going to lead the way? Is it going to be Ryder in his ATV or is it going to be Chase in the big truck? Chase in... All right, we are ready to get this mission started. Are you ready? Let's move the Paw Patrol Lookout Tower out of the way and we'll begin our journey. Yeah! Thank you for watching our playtime video about the wave of water. We saw to watch part two so you can see how the story ends on our next playtime video with me, Chase.